Hey guys, Kim here. By now you might have seen the, um, well, the pattern in my videos because I always wear the same thing because everything happened one day. I'm just filming everything. So anyway, this is the book review for The Summons by John Grisham. And I think I won this book at Goodreads a long time ago, but it took me a while to actually get into it. I'm sorry. But, uh, this book is, um, really really big probably around uh, seven or eight inches kind of thick um this is a signed copy where it is um this is where i learned about um way back in my early good read good read days um you know about the signed editions and sticker book book plate sticker whatever with their signature this is really nice um it's hardback so it looks like this it's brown i actually like hardbacks i prefer hardbacks over paperbacks but you know hardbacks can be really expensive and heavy so i don't really care anymore it's just as long as i can read the book it's the same content um as far as the book cover it looks really nice um looking at it now i still cannot correlate this one over what the book is all about but hey <laughs> um as far as the book goes as far as i can remember um there's a lot of issues here uh family life um struggles bonds and the morality of it all like um the guy if he was like thinking whether his father because I, I feel like they're not really close with his dad so so like um it's more like is my dad really a good person did he really do this stuff because his dad was a judge you know he's a very good judge he's a very good man and they live in a small, small town uh, somewhere in the countryside in the states and um yeah his fa his his dad is very well known and he's really good at delivering justice so um i kind of like this book in a way that it just makes made me think about a lot of things like wait huh is this even possible it made me think about tax taxes and laws here in the states and I still think that his brother is actually quite a good guy despite, you know, their differences. But in the end, there's like a plot twist, so I'm just like, wait a minute. But yeah, um, I think I rated this book 3 out of 5 stars, probably 3.5. I quite enjoyed it, but it took me a while to actually, you know, appreciate it for what it is, what it's worth. And I'm just like, huh. Okay, here we go. As far as character development, I feel like, um, was it the younger brother? Forrest. Forrest! Let me see here. Um, he's quite the black sheep. He's a really trouble, he's a real troublemaker, but he kind of gave his brother the benefit of the doubt because his other brother, our main protagonist, is, um, the more, more educated one. So, like, you know. Um, it's nice to see the family dynamics. Um, I feel like it's kind of scary because I, I thought I was like, wait, is the house hunted or something? But it's actually not. It's just, yeah, it's just like, what is happening out there? But yeah, I, I didn't know a lot of things about the laws or, or I'm just, I'm just like swept along in the story. And... I mean, I'm not, I think there's, there might be a second book on this one because I feel like the ending was like a cliffhanger, like dun, dun, dun. And I don't know. I was like, what? But, um, I might read the second one, but it will take me a while because I have a lot of books to read and do a review of. So yeah, there we go. Here we go. That's basically it for the review of the summons. I know I didn't say a lot, but but it's basically about, yeah, well, you know what? Just read it. <laughs> I'm going to give you anything more because I feel like if I say something, 
it will just give everything away. But I hope you pick up something, whatever I said. So there we go. Uh, lesson of the story is to give someone the benefit of the doubt and uh, trust your in trust your instinct and. And I feel like we all know there's different side and different story of the story. So just just hear people out, okay? Just don't don't stay close minded. Don't let your prejudice like um, take over your instinct or your your whatever. Just just hear them out and just feel and see the situation unfold and hopefully. Hopefully, it's for the best, I guess. So, yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope you like, comment, subscribe for more videos like Be Flat Face. And, um, yeah, really appreciate it. Goodbye.